Hey everybody, this is Ray the Video Guy. And recently I got to go to a webinar for Box Shot King. Now if you don't know what Box Shot King is, it's a piece of online software that allows you to create 3D images of books and software boxes and DVD boxes and reports and things of that nature. You see them all over the web. It also has uh, you know computers so you can put things on a computer screen, etc. for demonstration on your web purposes. Now one of the things they have on their screen or on their website is the two minute challenge which is where you can build or they build a 3d image within uh, two minutes without using Photoshop and we're gonna take that challenge today to see if we really can create something from scratch in under two minutes I've got a timer here and so what we're gonna do is we're gonna head over to my box shot King um, login which is right here and we're gonna start the timer and then we're gonna see if we can create so let's go and start. Okay, we're going to hit the Create button here. And we're going to choose one of these. We'll choose the Magazine Stack. Now in here, you can choose to upload a background, or we can choose one. We're going to do this completely from scratch. So we're going to do that. We're going to crop an image. And now we're going to put an image onto our page here. So we're going to hit Insert Images. And we've already got uh, an image that we've uploaded here. So we're going to put our, our super cool dude in here. We'll resize him a bit. All you do is click on the corner and you can make it as big as you want. And that's probably a little bit big. We'll shrink him down just a little bit here. Alright, cool. So then we're going to insert some text, which is right up here. And Super Cool Magazine. And this guy is on the cover because he's awesome. Oops. Do this. And we want our color to be white, so we're going to choose white. And we'll generate text, and there it is. Put it into our super cool magazine here. Drag him down just a little bit. And we hit finalize. Let's see how we're doing. we got 47 seconds. Will we be able to get our entire product done in these next 40 seconds? Oh, we're almost down to 30. Now this is much faster than other pieces of software that I haven't used. Well, there it is. You can remove the background and download. And let's see how we did here. Oh, 24 seconds to go. Look at that. So with 20 seconds left, we were able to create our magazine image and uh, create the 3D version of it. Now the great thing about this is it doesn't end right here. Now we've got our super cool magazine. But you can do all sorts of things with this. As you can see, we can do it in, in two minutes, but let's uh, let's check the rest of this out a little bit here. Uh, let's say we wanted to create this paperback book standing. Um, what we can do is we can actually go in and we can pull up something we've already created, a flattened version. Now this was created in Photoshop, uh, but that's okay. You know, nothing wrong with that. We can choose one of these here. Let's get a life with a spine here. And even though we're not on the two-minute challenge, you're going to see that it's very, very fast to uh, create something like this. Give it a second here. And here it comes. And I'm just going to tell it what to crop here. Hit crop selection. And there's our image. Hit that. Finalize. And within a few more seconds, we're going to have our book created. And again, I have other software that creates these types of things, but this is just so fast and so easy to use. Um, some of the other software that I have is great and, and have some advantages over this. Uh, for instance, in, in one of the softwares, I can move the 3D image a little bit, so if I wanted to tilt it back a little bit more, I wanted it to be slightly this way or that way, we can do that. In this one, you can't do that. It's, it's pre-made states like this. Um, but honestly, uh, you know, that's not a, an issue really. And the only other issue is, again, um, 452 by 600 is not a huge image, but it's not a small image. Definitely plenty big for your website. Uh, print, as long as you didn't want to have a, a giant version in, a, in something that you print out, it's going to look great. You know, some of the other software, you can choose the size that you want, and you can render it out to much larger files. But for 99% of all people out there, website owners and things, this is going to be a great piece of software for you. And another thing, just so you get an idea, they also have the Packager. And you see what the Packager is, is a way that you could say, um, 
you know, let's say you wanted to have multiple things in your product shot. So you wanted to have this, and you wanted to have a magazine stack. And whoops, and we've got two magazine stacks. Well, that's all right. And you wanted to have, you know, the other book here. This is oh, this is part two. You know, whatever it happens to be, and we'll throw this one in there just for fun. You know, you can do all of these different things and create an entire um, package system. You know, of stuff that you you want in there. So overall, I've got to say, Box Shot King really is as good as they say it is. It is very fast. I was able to create in under two minutes. I was also able to bring things in and and make them into a 3D product very quickly. Uh, like I said, I have other software that have some features this doesn't, like being able to move it in 3D space so you can get it exactly the way you want and, and creating an image that's much larger for print purposes and things. But this one also has a lot more options as far as software boxes and CDs and DVD boxes and business cards. I mean, there's just a lot more in here. So that's a huge advantage they have. Uh, plus the computer shots, you know, you can put it on a MacBook Pro and you can put it on a an iMac and things of that nature. So it's just a very, very slick software, very fast. And that's the other thing, too, is because it's not being done on your computer, it's being done on, on other servers, it is very fast. I have a fast machine, and when I do my 3D uh, product shots with other pieces of software, it takes a while to render it out. This is just much, much faster, and I really like it. So if you're looking for an easy way to start making product shots for your website. You really can't go wrong, Box Shot King. Uh, check it out, the link is below to get you there and, and uh, you try it out.